Hello, everyone, and welcome to Red United TV. It's your boy, Ivorian Spice, back at it again with a transfer update. And today, guys, I have news for you. But first of all, before I deliver you those news, remember to subscribe, smash that like button, and remember to share because sharing Ivorian Spice is caring. But back to this, guys. I am here to deliver you news. Manchester United have finally, finally signed a player. Eric Ten Hag himself has finally, finally got his first player through the door at Old Trafford at Carrington Training Ground. And for us Manchester United fans, we've been waiting for the longest. We've been pissed off looking at Sky Sports News and you see players in zero Zero players out, so many. We was mad, we was upset. We had news with Ronaldo going crazy, maybe potentially signing Ericsson de Young. Nothing came up, but today it is official. It is official because Taro Malasia has finally signed for Manchester United. And boy, oh boy, I am a left back. Let's just say all right, P to Luke Shaw and Alex Tellers because your position is up for grabs your position is up for threats bro it's up for threats bro it's up for it bro it's on a platter right now but big up to those who um eric ten hag especially for getting the deal done again stealing it away from leon big up to manchester United. but in this video guys i'm here to go through the the transfer itself the interview itself as well as he's had had his first interview for manchester united and also a bit about the player himself a little player profile but let's start it straight away with this news as you can see here guys manchester united tyro malasia's first interview in full um before before we even get into it let's just get to the part where manchester united have signed this wonderful guy you know manchester united new center malasia spoke to the club media team for an exclusive q and a following i really wanted to get the part where it says manchester united is pleased to confirm that taro malasia has joined the club signing a contract until june 2026 with an option to extend for a further year the dutch defender made 136 appearances for final and has represented his country at every level on the 16th senior squad with five full international caps to his name he's finally a red malasia said that it's an incredible feeling to have joined manchester united this is a new chapter for me a new league with a new teammate and a tremendous manager eric ten Hag leading us which is true guys a tremendous manager leading us that knows football not just kick the ball in the bin you know actually do some drills again Tyro Malasia said, I know from playing against a team in Eredivisie, the qualities that he has and what he has demand of his player. While I know that I'm still young and will continue to develop, I can promise that I can promise the United fans that I will leave everything on the pitch every time I pull on the red shirt. I always be thankful to finals for all that they have given to me and my family. None of this would have been possible if it wasn't for them. Now I'm ready to focus on on to the future with United and help my new club achieve success. And of course, he had some, he had an interview with Manchester United, which I won't show the video due to copyrights. You know, your boy doesn't really want to get done, but yes, I'm so delighted, guys. I don't, I just don't want, I want to know how you feel, guys. Let me know in the comments. Are you excited about this new left back for so little money? You know, and I, I it's all about the gems, undercovering the gems, you know. I've always been a fan of it, you know. All of these high priced players, high price bullet that don't show up you know don't turn up for match never really worked out but we're here we've got a coup a low risk signing but again he was asked a couple of questions which i will go through it he was like arts welcome to Manchester united how do you feel to be able to call yourself a Manchester united he said i think i cannot describe the feeling so much has happened in the last five few weeks and i'm happy to be here guys if you want to go on the mainnight.com website and you can see the the video of the interview he also was asked about his um, the time in your life, this time in your career, about what, what was made right for him. He said, I think everything, the way I spoke with the coach and I always dreamed about playing in the Premier League. So, yeah, it's all good. And there was a lot of links from him, of course. And he spoke to Robin Van Persie, Tahith Chung as well who was there as well. He also spoke about that. He said, no, I didn't, I didn't speak to anyone 
about the decision, but I spoke to in the past with Robin and I played with him and spoke with him and his experience in Manchester United. I've always had contact with Ta Taif and after that, after he moved to England. So yeah, he's always a good feeling. Um, regarding Robin Van Persie, he said, yeah, everything was good. He says that they were, their biggest club and the feeling was good and he, he and he loved it here. So that was Robin Van Persie doing his bit, you know, bigging up Manchester United. Big up to Robin Van Persie to get in the names in there, you get me. And of course, speaking about the Dutch legacy, Dutch players playing for Manchester United, he was asked about that, you know, excited, he's excited to be another one joining. He replied saying, yeah, of course, because now I have something to look up to because they've had great they've, they did great over here and i want to be part of that list dutch people who will be great you know he wants to be that i, I remember he was also spoken about he's, he was also asked a question about i believe the fullback these days fullbacks are important attacking weapon as well it's an important part of your game he said yes sure i spoke with the coach he has some great things to, to have to work on and but he'll say it will come with time you know and you and um, we've actually heard you compared your yourself with Edgar Davids because your tenacity, do you model your game on that as well? Yes, I spoke with him at the national team and he said, you're not on my level yet, but if you work with me and play football with me, you'll get there. So I'm, I'm curious about it, you know. Um, I, I'm, I'm so excited, guys, to see something like that, you know. Big ups to him as well. Like, the fact that um, it's been... Him doing his thing, coming from final, especially if you guys saw him in the Europa Conference League final, he did particularly well, you know, he really did. And back to him as well. If you go on to Twitter, you've got uh, you know, the report says that regarding Tyrone last year, I love music, but being on my own a lot or with my family, but I don't like to go out, go out or that kind of thing, it's not my thing. See, he doesn't even like to go out. He focuses on his football, on like certain mans that like going out, getting their haircuts and all that kind of stuff, dancing on holidays like Jesse Lingard does. But hey, it is what it is, man. You do what you want to do to make yourself happy. Tyrone Malassia also said, as a footballer, I am strong in defence. I love to attack. Yeah, I have a good drive and I never give up. I'm glad about that. And he, he spoke with Terry and Erga on the phone when everything was agreed and it was really positive vibes and feeling as he wants to improve everything he wants to win the prize. So looking forward to it. Like I am so looking forward to this situation here, man. Big up, to, big up, big up, big up to Terrell Malassia and and the, and the as well Manchester United to getting things done right in the right way. And if you look at Terrell Malassia's player profile, guys, because I want you guys to understand the type of players, you know, big up Square Cup, squ I mean Squad Qua. I don't even know I expect Squad Qua, um, who put this up. If you look at this now, if you look at Tyrell Malassia compared to defenders during the 2021-2022 Edivisie, most shots, most take on completed, most successful through balls, second most final um, third passes, third most tackle made, third most touch it in the box. Like, Man United have made a signing and you look at that, look at that stats, just look at it. It's just peak right there. We have signed a monster of a left back that's still young and that can still get better in time. And I'm I'm so happy about that, man. Really, yeah, man. You know what, yeah. Be in that kind of situation like that, you know, you gotta big him up. You got you gotta big up. Manchester United for that. You gotta pick them up, man. It's 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 what we needed as well, guys. Because I'm so excited to see a left back. Because I'm tired, man. And it's it's our first signing of the season. And I just want to know what you guys are feeling about this guy. Because this guy's it's just it's just good things. It's just it's just really good things, man. You just look at that. You you really look at that. The good stuff there, man. Malaysia will do well for us, man. Just look at that there, man. Look at that. Happy to sign. Just really, really happy to sign for us, man. Oh, big up to him, Malaysia, man. Really big up to him, man. Like, look at that. I don't even know what happened there. Look at that. Look at that in a training ground, guys, just before we're about to go off. But I like again, guys, as always, remember to subscribe, smash that like button. But let me know what your thoughts are on this transfer. Were you happy about this transfer? You know, uh, or you think we could have got someone better? And who else do you want to see next, guys? Because 
it is what it is, man. It is really what it is, man. But big up to those who have tuned in as well. It is your latest transfer. Manchester United have finally made their first signing. Ten Hag has made his first Ty um, first signing, which is Tyrell Malassia, the new left back. As always, remember, guys, to subscribe, smash the smash the like on the channel, and press the notification bell to get the latest videos and be the first to watch as well. And also remember to follow the socials in the description as well. And if you want to contribute to the channel, you can in the description and let me know. Big ups, everyone. Till next time, remember to keep it united and remember to keep it ready now because your boy is out. Peace! We sign off first signing. Yeah.